YouTube it's Saturday and I don't make a lot of videos anymore but I decided to make this video because um, a thought had came to my mind I was in the kitchen and I was making vegetable lasagna and um, I had read somewhere that one of the traits of people who are thin is when they, like say for instance they go to a restaurant and they order food, um, they, if they don't care for the food, uh, they don't eat it anyway. Or I guess if it was anything or anywhere that they had food and they didn't care for it, they just didn't eat it. And um, I do know even sometimes when, you know, I'm, I'm eating, sometimes if I don't like something, I'll kind of force myself to eat it because I don't want to be wasteful and um, I do respect the notion of not being wasteful but I was thinking as I had made and, and this is what I try to do too since surgery only make what I'm going to eat even for a day or two and and the reason why that is and this is one reason too why I don't meal prep is because one day I could really want something or even sometimes one minute I can really want something with the two and then the next minute I find it repulsive like ew um, I had wanted a piece of fish and I really didn't know what kind of fish or anything but anyway it's a local fish market so I had ordered some butterfish I'm going off topic but I'll get back to the topic but it connects I ordered um, some butterfish and I got it. I mean, it's fresh fish, you know, I don't know where they go. Like, where do you go and just know where the butterfish are in the ocean? But anyway, um, this fish looked exactly like a fish. And I know that sounds odd, um, but it turned me off to the point where I couldn't eat it. I mean, I tasted a little bit of it um, and I just couldn't do it. So, textures and things get to me a lot. Textures, smell, and like I said, one minute I can want something, and the next minute, ugh, it, I find it repulsive. So anyway, I say all this to say that I was making my lasagna, and I did have like extra leftover ingredients. Like I made the pan; it was my goal to make a small pan of it, and um, I had some extra noodles left over. Now, normally I would have said, oh, I can save that for another recipe. And I had like some of the little uh, cottage cheese mixture left over. I could save that. I could do this. I can do that with it. I can make this. You know what I said? No, I'm not doing that. I'm, I'm sorry to have wasted it. And next time I'll try to be more cognitive and more careful. But really, nobody is going to eat it. Um... I'm not going to freeze it. It's not going to, it'll stay in my freezer till the ice age comes again. Um, so I'm still like learning that, learning to make a lot smaller portions and not to be wasteful. But I guess my message here is that I am not going to um, overeat or just make additional food just because I have extra ingredients. Um, or like a little bit extra. It could be like a little teaspoon extra. And now am I going to put that teaspoon in my mouth? No, not, no. Why? Um, it's, you know, I made a recipe. I've used the ingredients. And now I'm just, you know, I'm going to clean up after that. I'm, I'm not going to just make something or just eat something just because it's there. I'm not going to eat something if I don't like the taste of it. Um, I'm going to either, you know, if somebody wants it, uh, you know, I can give it to them, but I'm not going to force myself to eat just because I don't want to be wasteful because I'm not a human trash can. Yeah. And I guess that's my, my message. I'm not a human trash can and I'm not going to be a human trash can. Um, if it's possible, I'll wrap it up and save it. If I don't want it and nobody else wants it, then, you know, you know, the only thing I can do is just say sorry, but not sorry, because it's not going into my body. Um, so anyway, that's what I came for on this Saturday with, I'm, I'm actually, what I'm doing is Saturday, I'm not combing my hair, I'm not putting, I'm not doing earrings, I'm not doing anything, I'm just at home, cleaning, taking my time, one thing at a time, one step at a time, and um, 
actually the only thing I have left over is that spinach that um, I am going to be keeping. I'll keep the spinach. Mm -hmm. I could use that for something else. But all, all the rest of that stuff, um, well, it's not all the rest of it. It was like a little bit of the cheese mixture and some noodles. But it's just a point. I'm not a human garbage can and I'm not going to treat my body like I'm a human garbage can and I think that that's growth that's what I think it's growth okay help everybody is doing well I'm doing well and um I shall see you later